Hello. Well, my last box set of drawers has turned up, so this is it. Um, and I am just going to start with the numbers. Fan is off. So hopefully that's loads better for everybody. Um, so six, four. So what I've got to do with these is let's find the smaller snips. There they are. I've got to chop off that part. And then, right, so this is this. I'm going to put this up and it's going to be where you probably can't see it, but I shall bring these down and bring them to do here. So that one goes there on the top deck. Make sure it sits down. 3064. Then for this one, I have to chop this side off. Now, I've only done a couple where I've cut the wrong ends off. So I'm hoping that I can continue. And I've realised something that it's the more I handle these stickers, that's why they keep um, keep what's the fine coming undone. But, well, no, he needs to come down a bit. Yeah, that'll just have to do. Oh. Seven two. This is perhaps the the tedious part of the job. Oh dear. But yeah. Three oh seven. Now we're on to the next. The next ones. So I'm going to put these here because I can't quite see on there. Right, so what are we after? 3078 comes. I'm using my book, which I got from. Um... Was it Dan Painting Anonymous? It was a free download, if I remember rightly. And I got it and I've laminated the sheets so I can wipe them off. And I've got the, I've had to buy these, obviously. And yeah, so it's quite a good book. And even better because it's free. Got some of the things in there. I don't really keep it up to track, which is, uh, I'm kind of like not kind of that person, but I want to be, so I try. And then of course I never finish it. Right, so after 3078, we have got Three three two five two six, right two five because that's just on this one. So let's just get there. It is, and I'm just going to use that just to chop off that excess bit of colour. Oh, and actually, one of me, I might as well just use these. Right, so well, these pots arrive. These things arrived this morning there we go so that's one done and always on the bottom you get these straggly bits of um manufacturing stuff right so that's that one done whoops sorry keep knocking you let's get a few of these out while we're there shall we Right, so now we're on. All right, let's put these into order, shall we? 50, 48, 50, 62, 64, 54. I hope you can see this. 40, 46, 28, 7, 1. They're so fiddly. Six three in there. Four one there. Come on. Four seven. All right, four five. And I check that I've got these right so I haven't mucked up. Three, three, 
2628. Yes. 40, 41, 45, 46, 47, 48, 50, 54, 62, 63, 64, 71. That's it for those. All right. So now I match them up into sets of four. One, two, three, four, and two. All right. So let's start with the snipping. The snipping and the sticking. So how is everybody? I think these are going to fit on my shelf. I think they'll all three will fit side by side. So once I've done this and I've tidied off that shelf, what I actually want to do is get shot of that bookcase because it's peeing me off and get AM Billy in here and I think that'll do better because it's more solid and that side hopefully I'm in shot yeah I think Billy will definitely um be better I might not be able to fit Pangea Boo up it Pangea Boo if anybody knows or wants to know is my daughter's um one of her bears that my ex-boyfriend's uncle got got her when she was little and as like some of the toys bear in mind he's probably about two foot and a bit and grubby because <laughs> he's been on several moves and of course she doesn't want me to get shot of it but she doesn't want to have it in her house you go figure. Fickle creature. But yes, so in the meantime, I've got that. So when I get a Billy bookcase, I don't think he's going to be able to stay up there. And I can't get a shot of him. No way, he's family. Oh, God, why are they so gotchy, you little oik? Right. All right, so that's another one put in they do look good right now on to this one. Oh, this is the problem when moving them about your fingers stick to them right. I suppose what would be easier is if I was to cut them all apart at the front but then no Hmm. Well, I had a weigh in this morning and a blood pressure and a doodah thing like that, and I was mightily peed off. What is the bloody point? That's all I can say. I haven't lost any this last week. Not lost anything. Didn't cheat this last week either. Ugh. So I'm peed off. Apparently some people say I've got to drink more water. So I'm going to have to do that, aren't I? If I can. Reminds me I've got to get some more water. I'll do that Thursday. Hmm. Oh dear, I hate it when I manage to put it on and it sort of goes too far away from the end. I want it close to the end. That's straight. That's not quite straight, but well, oh. Give you a bit of... Is there anyone on that? God, yeah, there is. Yes. This is a bit of a long-winded job. But hey. Yeah. So I've also made an order for my next month's supply. I'm going to stick with it because it um, gives me a chance to um, save up a bit. I've been doing my um, accounts. I've got a new system. I did do a video on it on my sort of, you know, how I fund my, not just funding my um, 
my um, diamond paintings. But I will be because I don't know if anybody knew that I used to have a budgeting channel. I had it first, like about oh gosh, before this one. I had it before. Um, it was oh two three years back now, probably. Golly, yeah. Anyway, so um, yeah. So I'm. And it was called Carpe Diem Does Budgeting. I know. I kept the name, didn't I? Carpe Diem Does Diamond Painting. And anything else that I do will be Carpe Diem Does Whatever. Because. Hmm. Oh, where did that go? Sometimes they have bits of plastic like that, bigger bits. Right, here we go. So, three, three, now I need three, six. I need to work out which ones. Oh, seven. Right, 07, 08, then it's 09, 85, 87. Right, get on there, there and that one there. Right, so here we go. These colours look really nice together, don't they? When we get to the three eights, that's going to be the fun one. Because there are a lot of them. And a fair few three sevens as well. Gosh, it's warm. Get the right side. Oh, I had a weird dream. Another weird dream. Driving this time. And trying to find across town. I knew which which direction we had to go in. First off, we were driving, and then we were meeting people. Then we bumped into people, and then one not had to go one way, and we had to go the other way. And then all of a sudden, we were in um, catching buses and trains. And um, and I was trying to hunt out my bus pass and my train. And I didn't have a train pass, but I had my bus pass. I don't know what happened to the car. But somebody else had that, I suppose. Yes. And I don't know where we were trying to go or what we were, you know, what we were doing. We were just trying to find our way home, I think, or something after going somewhere. After seeing around some dorms for somebody, I think it was. I've had the dorm dream before. We went up this big flight of steps and then you opened a room and then there was like this big dorm ahead of you, you know, around you. And it was, well, a dorm, what I meant by a dorm was um, one room which had four people sort of sections in it. More like a hospital bay, really, but it was, but it was like that dorm and then they had um, your kitchen. I suppose you could say it was more like a, um, a an apartment, studio apartment, really. But it was a dorm because everybody there was for students of some sort. And it was in the same place where there was a big shopping mall underneath. And... Um, and there were some people who were shooting at people and stealing stuff like for games and um, gaming consoles and things like that games and it was very weird and you just had to be very careful where you went and it was like in a futuristic world 
and then there was a big plinth that opened up onto this big um external sort of square and there was big plinths and up on the plinths were the what i call the bad guys because they were the guys that were shooting at everybody oh oh no that's three seven i've got to remember that whoops there we go um the guys were shooting at everybody and um it was yeah very you know so you had to try and um, sneak them but they were massive they were like robot type things and we had to try and um the people were trying to you know a lot of us were trying to um we had to get beyond them and then we could attack them from behind because that was where their weak spots were and we were um we were trying all kinds of ways to get forwards for them and i remember going up and rolling and you know doing those rolls and dives and everything else like that and i kind of like made it but i got collared behind a um a plinth a big plinth of um like a statue on it and this statue was one of the um was one of the the weird things that was you know turning against us and shooting at us and um and uh, i was stuck because somebody else because these people or no whatever they were these alien type robot things that were shooting at people they didn't matter if they killed their own they were not afraid of that so we were trying to basically jump in in front uh, you know or get behind so then the other people would fire at them and um you know to in to seeing us because it's like they only saw us but they didn't see the um the um the others there and there was one main one who was doing all the leading and he was the one that we were trying to get to he was purple for some strange reason well bluish he was similar to like that but no he was perhaps a lighter metallic -y, more like that but um he um he um well they just shot they just shot and the per the thing that i was behind it was scary because as they were shooting at the plinth and at him not realising, you know, that they were shooting one of their own. Well, they didn't care. Um, I was behind it. And so all the bits that kept falling off of the thing kept falling down and over my heads. And it was, I was like thinking, God, any minute now, there's a plus side to this, like, i.e. they're getting shot of their own. But at the same point, I'm in, I'm in the way. And so it was like, oh God, now what do I do? Then one of them on the, the big map, main one because he had his um his side guards who were next to him on other plinths and they could go round they could spin round the side ones and but the big one there was a little door at the bottom and if you got in there you basically got in and you could go in and control you know you could get the person who was basically you know it was like a gun turret i suppose you could think of it like because there were people inside who were using that but of course nobody knew that they were people only a few of us knew that there were they weren't these big monsters that were shooting at people it was somebody inside that using this thing to shoot us so lots of people were there thinking you know oh my god these monsters have come they're taking over us how can we win and we cow down to it and the ones in the mal were we were the free ones so as to speak it was very weird and um and occasionally there would be forays of normal looking people but they were the bad guys coming in pretending to be us and because a lot of the people who also would mill around in the sand a bit would um would see these people and they think they're one of them not knowing that they were the enemy and you knew it when it was the enemy because they would be forever trying to um to get us to look elsewhere you know to um distract us or make a scene or something like that but yeah we had to try and get through this door and this door was locked so we had to go and get some something to try and open it and you know people had tried all kinds of things we still don't know what what it was that would open it and we somebody had tried a knife somebody had tried a block to try and fit in the block that was there um all kinds of things and it was crazy because i like knew that i could get into it if i could get there i could get into it i don't know how i knew but i knew i could 
I don't know. I mean, I could get there and I could make, perhaps not get in, but I felt that I could get in. But it was really weird. And then you always wake up just as you see this big thing coming towards you and going, getting ready to like fire on you. You go, shit. And then you wake up and you're like, oh, my God, that was oh. Because you actually felt like you were in there and it was all, oh, I'm about to die any second. Very strange. But yeah, these are some of my dreams I get. Rather cool, aren't they? Really, I think. Anyway. Right, so eight, nine. Let's work these out. Oh, God. Three, seven, oh, six. Uh, three, seven, oh, eight. Three, seven, oh, five. Whoops. Twelve thirteen. Sixteen. I'm going a bit quiet as I paint it on. 27, 22, 90. Come on, get there. Thirty one, twenty six. Golly, it's just too many of these ninety. I don't know if I'm in shot. Three seven nine nine. Three seven eight seven. Three seven eight one. Oops. Eight, two. Seven. Oh. Seven seven nine. Seven seven eight. Seven seven seven. Is there a seven seven six? I mean, a 766, no, 776, isn't it? Yes, there was. Six. Um, then there's a ah, 774. I'm doing this back to front. Oh, no, I'm not. Seven seven one seven seventy. I know I go up that way and now I'm going down this way. Oh dear. No, I'm not. Oh shoot. Right, there we go. Right. Like that. Then we have Six eight, six six, six five, sixty one, sixty, um, Six fifty-three, fifty-two, fifty, forty-seven, forty-six, forty-three, forty. 
33, 31, 26, 22, 21, 16, 13. Right, there we go. So that is the first lot of four. That is the second lot. That is the third lot. Then we have one. That one. That one. That one. That one. Oh dear. There we go. Right. Oh, we're getting there right now. Let's start. This is where you're checking. Just to double check that I've got them all in the right one. Then you're going to tell me after the event. Oh, well, that one's mixed up. No. 305. This is the longest bit, I think. The others I've got all got in the bags already, so they could just be popped in. Oh, shoot, buggered this up already, haven't I? Is that the right one? Yeah. Okay, this is where we have to do a quick remend. Because... So this is my third one where I've made a bit of a boo-boo. That one goes there. There. I mean, it'll, it is what it is. And then it was the other one, which I think was that one. Yes, it was that one. So that's there. And then that's got that side. There we go. Not very noticeable, is it? Right, now I've got to in order since that one five six oh dear go there is going to be awesome when it's done oh and then i better go and look online at ikea oops so yeah i've got a fair few fun projects coming up that i want to do
Do you know what? I really love that colour combination. Awesome, isn't it? Well, well, sexy. Wah. Sexy as Wang Yibo and Shao Zanikas. Oh, gosh, yes. Yep, that one twenty two. That side. Yeah, getting a Billy bookcase would be the best one. I mean, I've got a Billy bookcase in the corner there, but it's got some books on my records. Actually, my records could perhaps go in one of these cubes. Oh, I'll have to, I'll have to have a think. But then I've got to get to that corner then, haven't I? Oh dear, no. Where are we now? 31 minutes. Oh my gosh. This is the bit that does take the longest. But I have a feeling this will be the last. The last. I won't need to do another video of this. Oh, my wrist is still hurting. It started feeling better from having this on. And this bit helps support from that thing, from digging right up and making that whistle. But it's, um, and it was doing better. And then, of course, I had to take it off to sort out the scales because I was taking everything off um, to weigh myself. And um, then as I was trying to put it back on, I don't know what happened, but my wrist went again so all the good that I'd done it by having this on was lost <laughs> in a little space of time Forty-seven, and this one. Right. Hopefully, that'll still have a bit more stick to it. Hmm. Seven. Yeah, half term, kiddies are off. Mm. I think I've got to find somewhere better for my paintings to go. Actually, my Calyx unit in front that way. I really do need to um, to sort out, empty them out, get shot of the bits that are inside it that I no longer need. Oh no, it's not going to stick. Stay stuck. I'm going to have to keep an eye on that one. Now it's coming off again. 
Right, so here I have Oh, what can I do with it? I'm going to have to move all that. So I can get to me flipping whatnots, drills. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. doing is piling it high there it is right at the bottom <sighs> that's what i need uh. right find the end there it is Now my hands are going to get the shakes. Yeah, oh well. That'll just have to do. It's... Oh god, it's creased. No, it won't have to do. Oh shoot. Take my glasses off. There we go. The snip down the middle where it got raised. Right. And smooth out, and there we have it. It is mended. Right. God, it's warm. Oh, my God. Right, I'm going to have to get a drink of water. Oh. <laughs> when I... I knocked the penny jar over and it went onto the fridge. That bit has just fallen into the fridge from when the penny jar dropped and scattered. Okay. Oh dear. I've got to sort this house out. I keep meaning to do it. Keep putting it off. But it would look good when it's all done. I've just got to be brave. <sighs> right. What number's that? Right, three, seven, five, six. Nope, that's not calling me down as much as the fan would. Right. This is where it would be good to have um, a pause on my 
I didn't do it again because I didn't like having that clippy cam thing stuffed down, taking up too much room. And then, um, you know, and I certainly won't go and pay the 81 quid or whatever, 89 quid to um, get that pause whatnot thing button for um to get the oh i don't know what i'm talking about hopefully you do god and three eight is the massive one decent because while that one's still there it's just reminded me of the old bag so uh, that definitely will go but yeah it's it's a sunny day out there I would have the window open, but the noise is bad enough here and the cars come through the, the vent that's sort of right in front of me. If I have the window open, it's even louder. 3772. Yes. This is going to look absolutely lovely when it's done. Now, I know I'm going to have lots of containers, sort of storage for spare drills. I mean, I have the the cases, two large, four, no, 240 cases, that was it, um, for my um, Diamond Art Club drills, spare drills. And then I have this for my Ever Moment. And then I have the boxes, and that is for my other spare drills, you know, from Budget Ones and other companies. They're all going to go in that one. And those ones are then, so then I've got three lots. So how I'm going to use them are my, um, my DAC drills will be for filling in for when I miss out some. And my Ever Moment draw drills will be for um for obviously my cross stitch conversions and if i haven't got enough then i might just nick from the ever from the diamond art club but i don't know whether i will do that because i want to keep them all the same i know diamond art club drills are good but when they're on like a um a canvas that isn't a diamond art club i don't know how well they're going to fit on and be good so um that i have to um have to you know test out possibly at another stage and then ones in my boxes will be for things that I want to do you know like um craft projects with them and I think that would be pretty cool Yeah, I've got quite a lot of craft projects that are all lined up. I was working out a schedule, but then it's very hard to do a schedule with my filming because, you know, creating it so that there's something different, you know. I like say Mondays will be whipping chats, Wednesdays whipping chats. Um, Friday's whipping shirts or something like that and then perhaps a craft project day and then um you know boxing kitting down kitting up you know trying to fit like all those sort of things in and then I thought well I've already got like about 
I think I've got about six videos ahead. So I might just, I might be able to wind a little, a little bit more. But then I'm a bit of a, a person that just wings things and just says, oh, well, we're having this up. And it also keeps you, because if you don't like something, you know, then people might not watch on those days. And I'm desperately trying to get the algorithms to share my content. I suppose I should really go on to, I don't know, Instagram and um, share on there. Maybe get a few more that way, but I'm not very consistent. 387, all right, nearly done on these. Oh, come on. There we go. And the last one for the three sevens. All right. There we go. Right, here we go. And obviously I've got these and it doesn't have blank on there. So I'm gonna have to create my own label for blanc. Right, three, eight, four, eight, three, eight, eight, four. Three, eight, forty. Three, eight, thirty. Right. Three, eight, four. Fifty-two. just so many of these aren't there 54 i would fast forward through this but it, it'll just switch off if i tried 49 42 51 34. Now, all it is is you're hearing is me just saying the numbers, isn't it? Oh dear, I don't know. 92. 70. Oh god, don't spill them. 15. 44 is in there. 59. Oh my god, how many more? Look at them all. Look at them all. Oh Jesus. 58. I think it's right. I'm just going to put them into their appropriate piles and then reorder them. Oh my god. Oh no, I'm bored. At least this is the last one, isn't it, really? It's 
the last set. So let's look on the bright side of life. Do 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 do. When you think of it, a life is full of shit. Da 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 da. Oh no, between there. 21, 21 today. Oh, what a lovely war. Oh, what a lovely war. Sorry. Right, 46. Hmm. Oh, God. Anybody else bored already? I know I am. But it's going to look so good when it's done. Yes, I know, I know, I know. But, oh, this is the bits that just, oh, I lose the will to live at times. All right. 38.27. Fifty-six. Sixty-one. Sixty-six. Get off my finger. Forty-five. Oh my God, guess what I appeared today? I don't know if you remember me saying the other day, well, a few weeks ago, I got two big, um, I got a big letter with a form from my bank asked me to write down my business details and everything else and it's about as complicated and, and as clear as mud well then the other day I got two of them so two of the same form and guess what came today another two so now I've got loads of them and I still have trouble doing them they can send me them to the cows come home but unless somebody's going to help me sit down and do it then you know I think the chances are of them getting done are going to be pretty um, interesting. I've got to do them, so I might just end up doing them stupidly. And they'll just have to take what they can from it. 3893. 3H20. Oh my God, I've got loads down there and I've still got a handful. 3890. <sighs> 50. And that can move up a bit then. 81. Eleven. Yeah, I don't know why they keep sending me these forms. I mean, it, they must think I have a corporate head office or, or an accountant. Who knows? Just little old me. I don't earn anything now, much now anyway. So, um, I don't know why. I've got 25. We're getting there. 7. Six, thirteen, eighteen, forty-three. There we go. Oh God! Oh eight. Oh, face up the right way, you little. I don't want to bend you. 
Oh God, we're there, we're there. 53 and 63. Oh, hello, flipping Lulia. Right now, first four. Right, yeah. think what else to talk about I mean you know oh I am um, phoned up no I didn't phone up yes I did I phoned up my uh, the ADD people and just said my daughter's not going to be doing it because she ain't got back to me and there's no point And um, and so they they've spoken to the thing. I mean, it still can be done. It would just be done differently. So they messaged me back and said, or emailed me back and said, yeah, they're just trying to work out another way around it. I mean, Courtney, the person I spoke to first off, she said, no, there will be a way around and um, we'll suss it. It just might mean that we spend an extra hour doing it. But in this one, they now want to know about the um, the apt person, the iAPTS person who um, referred me. Well, I didn't have a referral from the iAPTS person. My doctor, I went to my doctor and I told him lots of things and he referred me. So I'll have to, um, hopefully that won't make a difference. Still got a referral. And I've been on it for two and three quarter years. So I'm blowed if they're going to shunt me off and say no. Because I will cry, I will cry, I will cry. Yeah. Do this, and then I'm going to order a Billy. Mind you, Billy, he's going to take 40 or 30. No, oh no, did it come down? By the way, 25, 20, 30, 40 quid to deliver, which is crazy. I'll have to have a check because I might have to rethink that because if it's going to come to it and it's going to cost me more than the flipping um, bookcase I might have to wait till I need some other things oh, my diary came today it wasn't the one that I usually get but I'm going to get that one in uh, nearer the time for next year and I'm going to have that because this one I got is a um, different one it's this one I, I get these ones because I like them and this is a lot thinner than the one I usually get because the one I usually get has a big it's a page a day this one's this big I mean, it might work out. I mean, I've still got that, but in the other one I get, that is like covered over two pages. But I can still write in there. It'd just be smaller. Because what I tend to do is I use a pencil and I will then, um, whichever day we're on, whichever day a payment goes out, I'll write it down in here. So sometimes I have them ahead, advanced, and then I'll... Um, I will, um, you know, mark them down. And then in this bit, then I have those sticky notes. Um, 
don't know what I've done with them. They're around here somewhere. And then I'll put on there like a sticky note. See, that's why a page a day worked better because I could fit quite a few sticky notes. Um, but anyway, sticky note there with um, the payment, you know, which which company and which payment. And then when it's been, when I've paid for it, I take it off of that one and I stick it onto the next month's, the next month's um, one. And so basically all I'm doing is moving the sticky notes throughout the, the diary, you know. And then I can see what else, what I've paid and what I haven't paid. And then underneath I can write like um, uh, other payments that I've paid out which weren't in with the bills. And on the bigger one, they also had a big bit at the back. I don't think they've got it in this one. Planner. Must be. No, that's 2025. Ah, they have. So then I can um, write in here, like, you know, credit cards, Klarna's, clear pays, um, and then bills and then extras and things like that. I can write down there and then I can then I can total it up and see if it tallies. So, oh, that's good that it's got that. That is good. Oh, this one I might be able to, but it's a bit thin. I'm not used to it being thin, but I suppose I get used to it. That one, because we're already halfway through the year, it was um, 4 99 or 4 49 something like that. Uh, and I've got to get back on track. And there's me saying, oh, yes, I must just go to Billy, get another Billy bookcase. But we will get there. I will get round to doing it, things. this oh i don't want 38 there oh that's 18. right so that is that lot then it is that one then it is one two three four that one that one Right, let's just get these done first. I'm starting to wonder whether my maths was correct. And I have got enough. I'm sure I had some spare. But we will see. Yeah, must crack on and sort out my finances, work it all out. And yes, when I was doing my bills the other day and I got about half an hour's video, I did 26 minutes, I think it was, and then I realised I'd missed out some of my bills. So I had to scrap that video and redo it again. And then when I finished that out, I realised I'd forgotten one bill that I was meant to put on. I didn't scrap it, it's out there. Or it will be out there shortly. But yeah. And in that I did my um, roll of the dice for my um, diamond painting fund game that I do. morning I have done another two of these I've yet to seal those but um yeah because they're just um 939s 
for the bit that is trousers, wangy bows trousers. I've got some unboxings to come. First, I've got to do them. Now, where's my little, my little thing, you do? I've got a board here, which I've written rough things on, which I want to do for my filming. So, I've just marked, knocked some bits off. Oh dear. Right, so it is. Now, this might take a little bit of a while and it might not happen. But you know me, I do like to plan and then then everything changes. But I want to try and... Oh God, that was close. I nearly thought I did the wrong one again. Um, but I want to um, try and stick to this. And that is... I put Monday for a whip and chat, Tuesdays for DP crafting. And that means I've got shed loads of items that I'm going to craft with. And I mean, you could class this as crafting because it's, you know. So that's that. And I've got a whole list of things to, to craft with. I've got a little um, thingy jig of everything that I'm going to do on that. Then Wednesday, another whip and chat. Uh, Thursday is unboxing, kitting up, kitting downs. Any one of those. Because I won't always have things to unbox and I won't always have things to kit up or kit down. So if I spread them all out over just one day a week, then I'm sure I can manage it somehow. All right, so then it's Friday's Cross Stitch Conversion Day. Saturday Whip and Chat and then Sunday is going to be budgeting for my DPs and things like that. So I hope well, if there's anything else you would like to see please mention down in the comments. I will still want to try and do that read from that storybook, you know, from those kids ones while I diamond paint on one. So, but it's a bit tricky. I think I should have got that spray can of white paint. I didn't. I got black one and it was reduced to $3.99 for the can, so from $4.99 or $5.99. So I think I ought to go and get that white. Oh no, I got some white paint, didn't I? But yeah, I think I prefer to get the, um, the spray can one, actually thinking about it. Because it's quicker. Right, so that's the next four. Then there's that one. Ready, 
Sixty-three, sixty-six, oh, and it jumps up to eighties. Oh, those are quite nice colours together as well. Three, four, five, six. That one. One, two, three, four, and then two, and then one for these. Right. So we're on to these ones now. So I need one, two, three, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and two boxes spare. God, that was a close call, wasn't it? Very close call. Right. And in those two boxes, I'm going to put the Smith Speeds ones. Because on the Smith Speeds ones, I like to have, um, when I'm doing a cross stitch painting, uh, ever moment, don't always have the right colours. So I'll need one for 762s, 747s, 757s, um, a crew and blank. But well, oh, I've got a crew, so blank and yeah, miscellaneous ones. Eight two nine. Right. Hmm. <clears throat> This is going to be thirty. Yeah, that'd be quite good then. So I can fit all my cross stitch conversion ones in here. And who knows, maybe then I won't need to actually take them out and put them into pots. I can then just use them from this. Because when I use my cross stitch conversions, I'm doing that alongside my um, Threadbare app. And that means I just see the number. And then I can just look on my app to see what the symbol is. That is my plan. Well, it would be my plan. If these were individual and I could just sort of, if they were, you know, and I could just have it all filled with the diamonds. So maybe that won't work. <laughs> oh, well, because I'd be emptying them out of bags then, wouldn't I? Well, we will see. Nope, that's not it. Don't jump the gun. It is these ones, 36, 33. That were a blooming close. Yeah. Mind you, I used to do it out of baggies one point. Don't want to go back to that. God, the static I remember. <sighs> twitch, twitch, shiver, shudder. Right. 
Another one there. I have to um I think what I have to do is I have to print out some sheets for my um for my accounts for when I do it. Because I think that'd be quite a good one for when I do my business account size. Yes. then I can just fill it in and then I can just transfer it over. I'll have a working out sheet in the bottom part of it. Oh, I must remember to do my accounts for last year. Could have had them done ages ago but Cast out there. Mind you, I don't know what time it is, so it probably is because time is kicking on. Another one done. These are long-winded jobs as like, you know, any kind of storage preparation, you know, be it whether you do it, however you do it, uh, in the boxes or whatever. Maybe that's what it is, why I'm not losing, because I'm not drinking enough water. I just think after a while your body realises and thinks, God, it's starvation mode. And it just sort of decides to keep on, keep hold of everything. Your fat stores, because it thinks you're in famine mode. well god some of them are crooked oh well Rumbles, get on there. That's better. Oh, crumble! I could do with a lovely um apple crumble. Mm. Weatherspoons did a gluten-free crumble, so they said it was gluten-free. It was in there. Ujima Flip, their nutritional value guide. So every now and then I would go and treat myself to that. And I didn't feel, I didn't feel any oddities. Right. Golly. 
nice little pile of um, bits. <laughs> can't wait to unbox those um oh it seems um that my um my one with the diamonds i think it's those are out with um dpd or with dpd now i think it is i might be wrong but yeah my Diamond Art Club, I can't wait on that. I've got a new box, one painting which came in a new box, which I'm blimmin' pleased at. Now, yes, Cat, remember to peel off the backing. It does help, honest. Yeah, um, and I've got an idea what to do with that mm, box. that one so that's going to be um, shown in a DP crafting doodah I like it when you can use you know more of the item I wish they still included the tweezers and the um, and the what's it called the tweezers and the what is it called oh god and the washi tape and i didn't mind the the mag um the cover minders either because whenever i had my craft fairs i'd sell them <laughs> So that was always um quite fun, as well as the um the magnets that I used to make out of the um the enamel pins. Three, eight, five, seven. Get off. Under all these lights, I don't think that helps. Gosh, three of these it took. I'm so glad I decided to do four. It would have been nice to have had one per bucket, but if that was the case, I mean, then I could have done my um. Because what I would have quite liked was to, to get some, you know, like the um, bottom of the trays, like a tray, flat tray bit. I'd like to get a flat tray bit which would fit into them with the grooves. So then I could just do that and then line them up and, you know, use it. But I don't know how practical that would work if it's all full. But then it would have been easier either way to do my... um. cross-stitch conversions then I could just pull out a tray and they're already there loose but that would mean I'd need a lot more than these and the towers I've already got right this one Golly, golly. Uh, 
Now oh, get on straight. You're about as straight as a drunk person. there. Right, last ones. One, two, three, four, five. Short. Yep. Happy. Oh, dear. Day's nearly gone already. Mm. When I have done these. Then I'll be getting those baggies out of the box, except for the big ones, because the big ones won't fit in. I think I have to find a smaller box for those to go in, because they're in that big box, which is a little bit too big for them. Get on. Oh, well, it's sort of on. It's a bit crooked. Another one. Right. Oops. This is like whenever you're going somewhere, the journey home, the journey to where you're going to is done relatively quickly. Except for the last sort of little bit and then it seems to take forever. It's a bit like when you're coming home. You get so far and you think, oh. We'll be home in 20 minutes and why does that 20 minutes seem to last for hours it's a bit like this project i feel like oh the end's in sight and yet they seem to be taking forever Bloody hungry again. I don't know how anybody can live off of this. Right, we are very nearly done. Mm. 
Oh dear. Well, there we go. And we have just uh, got to trim these. I meant to do these for um, guillotine. Right, there we go. Right, these two are going to be on their own. This one. The R two hundreds. Do this one up. Oh dear. Oh, I can't do that now. I have to go there. Damn, I was going to have. I'm doing this one this side. So I've got room for blonk. There, so I've got room for Blanc there. Right. So that is all that done. Mm. There we go. All right. Now, let's tidy up, move this out of the way. So silly little plasticky bits from the bottom of the boxes that just sort of cling on. And also the little square things to my sticky fingers and my clammy hands. Right, so we have that. Now let's move that out of the way. And we need to get. The drills, which are here. Obviously, I have some big bags, but they won't go in. You know, quite a few big bags. So the big bags, things are going to go timber in a minute. I can hear, I'm waiting for it. thinking about it it's the um the slicey friskers thing all right so i've got a massive bag of 3799 so i can go in that big bag 3840 3865 that one might fit in 5200s that one probably fit in no. that one that one that one will probably fit in and that one so they can go in there Right, so these ones I want in, if I can. Right, so if I get any of these numbers, then I'm going to sort them out. Right. Now, three, seven, five, six. Now, I wonder if I can just... That's 
work. I don't know how if that's going to work or be a bit, ugh, but it'll work for some of them. All right. Three, six, eight, eight. Three, eight. Three, six. What's that one? Three, eight, four, seven. Three, seven, two, two. fit in so we'll have to be folded up. Three seven nine nine. No three seven seven nine. Three eight four six. And also I can see for the colours. Three seven six six. There it is. So it's quite handy having the colours there keeping a bit of that on because then I can look at the colour here and think right okay I know that one and then look and then when I see roughly you know, that colour then I'm all right so that's there three seven six eight oh oh no Oh, shit the bed. I've lost a colour. So that means all these are round the wrong way. I'd need to make them all. Bugger. I didn't do any of the checking, did I, on this one? I checked so far and then I stopped checking. Yeah, it's there. But I didn't have the thing, did I? Mm. Oh, right. That one's going to have to go at the bottom deck for the muck ups. Oh, that's so annoying. I will at some point rechange this then because I'm going to have to. My head, my OCD won't cope with it. Three, three, four, one. Oh, I want to cry. 3801. Yeah, I can't just move some of them on because they're all going to be in the opposite side then. 3733. Three. It's a pink. There it is. That's it, it's behind the camera. 3721. Three six eight five. There we go. Oh, oh, I was doing so well, and now that's really made me peed off now. Feck. Did I do a three seven four seven? Hope I haven't got it because I want to put it in this bag if I have. Three seven and a three three seven one. None in there. No, I haven't got a three three seven one. So that one can go in there. Really, I could put those. See that big bag that's in there. I could, Make put that into a smaller bag, really. All right, let's put that one in there. Three seven four seven. And then if I do come across one, then I'll see that already there. Three seven seven four. Three three five four. I won't need to do them all. It'll just be up to that one there. And then those down, which I'm going to have to redo. 3354. 
Oh. Now it's 3-7. God, thank God for that. I thought I'd bug it up again. <laughs> Everybody else get confused with some of these numbers. You look at them, you go, oh, what's that one? Where is it? That one doesn't have a home. And then you realise, yes, it does have a home. 3861 and 3864. 3861 and 3864. Oh, that's handy. Oh, 3860 can go in there. 3810. See, some of them will fit in like that, but some won't. 3857. Three seven six one a blanc. So I'm gonna put that one in there. Three seven five three. It might fit in here. Yeah. So nothing else needs to go in there. Three seven. 40 3811 3609 3787 it's hard to see some of them because they're there sort of in those ones and i can't see them for the camera 3761 Three, three, two, five. Three, three, two, five. Okay. Oh, oh, yes, three, three, two, five. Uh, three, seven, three, eight, oh, six. Six. Three eight three three eight zero oh, two. Three eight three six. Three eight three five. What's that one? Three eight three nine. Three eight thirteen. Three three four oh, we are nearly there, folks. Three three four oh, that's that one. Three seven oh six, that one. Three seven fifty. Oh dear, just about bits in there. Hmm. And three seven seven seven. Look at how many I've got in there. Three seven seven seven. There we go. Right, that is them all done. So we have all three towers done now, and all I've got to do is she says all I've got to do is redo all the stickers because I've got to do this blibbing one, haven't I? Mind you, those ones I don't need to do, and I might. No, I'm going to have to do all those. Oh, for God's sakes. Any rate, so there we have it. Right, so on that note, I hope you've um, enjoyed having a look at this tower unit. And um, yeah, it's all, you know, all easily accessible. I can see exactly what's what. And yeah, I'm I'm really pleased with that. Yeah. And I'm hoping, well, if I get the Billy bookcase, they should fit three across. But well, so on that note, I'm going to love you and leave you and I will see you very soon. But if you wouldn't mind liking, commenting, subscribing and sharing, that'll be blimmin' wonderful. Thanks a lot then. Tutty bye.